Oh god, that's a lot of enemies. But I think I found a new house. We just need to clear it out for, of a few unsavory inter individuals. I found myself a new house. It is a uh, one by two space. That is meant to hide me from my demise that would otherwise occur from everything around my, around where I am. I am currently hiding out in a village. Oh, cool. I found a village, by the way. Is it corrupted? Partially. Well, then it'll get corrupted later, too, so... Okay, so apparently this let If I get feathers, this thing will let me fly. But no, this village is corrupted. I'm just currently waiting out the blood moon. Yeah, I get that. This witchery, Tanya. Here for a spell. Just one spell shape. Funny. So So I have a villager corpse. Well then. Okay, I know how I must survive this night. Here, I have your, I have your dead friend. I was just beating up a skeleton with this dead villager. Well then. Okay, so I have an inf I have an affinity orb, right? A what? Affinity orb is for Aura's Magica. Okay. I tried using it. Twitch, Twitch, you can no longer feel your brain. In the name of Pizza Lord, charge. A waffle is just a pancake with the syrup trap. Did everything just taste purple for a second? You concentrate on the orb, but only wind up cross-eyed. That sounds about right. And then I decided I was a lemon for a couple weeks. You're convinced the pumpkins are trying to get you. And you will never speak of what you saw again. Yeah. You have, you have now left Reason and Sanity Junction. Next stop, Looneyville. Nice. You will never speak of what you saw again. Is it still a blood moon? I can't tell. Everything's red. Uh, I still hear everything around me.
Oh, it suddenly just got bright. Yeah, I use magic. Take me to the chalk zone, magic chalk. Please. I'm going to see about finding anything of interest in this village before I burn it to the ground. It's no, it's not savable. By the way, you, just to let you know, you also have the best, like, pickaxe you can have right now. A silver leaf pickaxe, not a pickaxe, an axe. You get it from your book. Under remember. I currently have a full inventory, so I'll hold off. Yeah, probably a good idea. I got some ink and some paper over here. Do we need those? Yes. We will actually need a lot of ink. So any squids you see, feel free to murder them all. I don't care if they go extinct. I got ten ink so far. I'm also going to deposit some things into this random chest. Because I know I we'll need, need that for uh, Thumbcraft. A lot of that for Thumbcraft. I'm currently collecting villager corpses. Ah! Motherfuck! My shit! Yeah, so you know what? This area is actually on. It does seem pretty uncorruptible. I'm not certain if it is uncorruptible, but you know what? Two tainted creepers exploded over here, which leave fabricate uh, fabric taint. On the ground. Fibrous. Yeah, so they exploded over here and the area is still pretty fine. <clears throat> so did you just delay the blood moon? No, I skipped it. I'm not gonna lie, I think the nether might be our best bet. Okay. I have a lot of stuff to move to the nether. As do I, it's just a matter of getting there without getting everything there without dying. Because there's a lot of things nearby that can and will murder us. Uh -huh. Cold blood. We could do that, or... Tell me, how many dirt blocks do you have? 
Not a ton, but I have a ton of cobblestone. Because I'm looking at a Sky Island real net, real quick. It's literally just a chunk of biome that was zooped up there. Oh, that'd be cool if that wasn't corrupted. That'd be perfect. That's why I'm trying to check it out. Fuck it, I'm gonna, just gonna get a shit ton of... Oh, I see it. Oh, you see it? Oh, you teleported to me. Yep. By the way, you have a zombie on your ass. Yeah, he was behind you to begin with. Oh, hey, look at this. I'm currently just trying to get up there to get a closer look. Well, there's another one of those tower things. The, the wizard tower things. I know, I was going to take a look at that after I got to see the biome. I'm going to use the wizard tower to get up there faster. <laughs> By the way, there's something... Ow. There's a pedestal up here if you want to take a look at it. Maybe in a little bit. Oh, uh, well, I did take a look at it. Oh, shit, there's epic bacon. Nope, we don't want to go up there. Corrupted? Slightly. Hmm. Probably but, out we can just shave it off. Um... Okay, I'll go look at it more. I'm just trying to think of alternatives, man. Nope, it's completely corrupted. Shit. No, the part that scares me is that I know what it is. That is a special island that has mob spawners in a singular room. So imagine like 15 mobs that'll spawn the moment you open the door. And by the, open the door, I mean break the wall. You can see why I'm like, I don't exactly want to deal with that. So, I got two ender pearls. I had like three. I see the village corpses. <laughs> it tells you what they were willing to trade. 23 coal for an emerald. Nice. I'll take that. I think my inventory is full again. Yeah, you should grab this onk, this rod or whatever. I don't think this is one of those ones that turns into emeralds when you drop it. Nope. That's cool. Uh-oh. But I'm being lagged to death. It's not good. Should have remembered about that. Uh huh, this area is still uncorrupted. Even after they blew up, the corruption moved in a little bit. But it just couldn't corrupt it. My sky's bugging out. Do we want to just make our own sky island then? 
I'd say Sky Island or Nether. I'm leaning more towards Nether for the time being. Just because I'm currently just walking around, I'm seeing some aura nodes that have been that have corruption on them, which worries me. Um, some aura nodes are are ones that are about corruption. The one that's over here by me is an aura node that is uh, about nature, so it's going to be pure. But no, it's currently, I'm just, what I've been doing this entire time was I was running around trying to find an area that hasn't been corrupted yet. You know, protect the nature, man. Okay. That whole deal. Currently, I'm leaning towards anything that's not the fucking Twilight Forest. Do you want to see what I'm doing? Um, I'm currently taking a look at something real quick. So it looks like these wizard towers, while they may be on corruption, aren't corrupted. They get fabricated taint inside of them, which can continue to spread. So they may not be corrupted at the moment, but they will be. <laughs> I can see the other uncorrupted spot, which is right next to a Twilight Forest portal. <clears throat> Fucking clay golems. Found an anvil. Magic fucking lamp. Nice. Killed by a brutish zombie, which was apparently also invisible. So I've got a plan. Um, yeah, it's just straight up looking like. This area is uncorruptible. I found two dimensional stones, some thalmio mangots, fine. Interdiction torches. Ooh. Those things are actually pretty cool. I have two of them in here. I forget what they do, but they're pretty cool. Some epic bacon. I'm just going to say we claim this as a home base for now. Because it's looking like it is uncorruptible. So is the area I'm at. Well, I have an actual defendable position. What the fuck is attacking me? I just need to worry about clearing out the basement. Oh, yeah.
Yeah, no, I'm gonna go see. The chest up there is full of stuff that I just kind of put up there. I just look off in the, into the distance and I see a rainbow of waypoints. You too? <laughs> yeah. I have to wait anyways for my for my plan to actually work. So Could you just teleport me to you? The problem is there's a spawner down there. You got this. Got a plan, you distract them. Oh god. I'm fairly certain I can hurt them. I, I can hurt you. You know, it would be really helpful if these showed up, these most current does showed up on my fucking minimap, but of course they don't. Why would they? Are you... Okay, yep, yeah, I don't, I don't think this is gonna work out well. Okay, so what we need to do is, we both need to go down there. And one of us needs to distract the fucking golems while the other one takes out the spawner. I got a plan. Is your plan TNT? No, close enough to though. Did you light the room on fire? Uh, you know what? That staff that you told me to take? Good idea. Did you take out the spawner? I'm trying to. Every time I spawn in, there is actually no way out. I die almost instantly because <laughs> I destroyed the ladder. <laughs> I got rid of it. Cool. Or I think I did. You did. Where the hell did the skeletons... Oh, from our graves. Um, yeah, breaking graves can be a pain here. I say we just take care of it now while we can.
So, welcome to my crib. I don't like it. Fuck off, we just did all of that work to clear it out. I know, and I died like 11 times there. Oh, hey, look we at that. We all died like 11 times there. Bean. What? So uncorruptible, huh? What the fuck? What are you looking at? God damn it, fuck it, we're leaving then. I mean, all you have to do is break it whenever it comes in like this. That's what I was doing with our other base that we had like this. The hunt continues. I need a sword at some point. Because I need a lot of wool. If you need a lot of wool, then why don't you make a pair of shears? Uh, I need to go to the Twilight Forest. Touche. Yep. Figured that would be your response. Unless you want to do it. Fuck no. <laughs> That's what I thought, too. <laughs> Uh-huh, the spider thing's back. Oh my god, it's actually pushed back what little taint got in here. This place is uncorruptible. Do you finally want me to show you this place? I don't like the idea of it being one thing's holding back the corruption. Well, that this one thing is holding back and pushing it back. I mean, originally when I did this, I had to deal with the fact that I did not know that there was anything that could keep back the corruption. So, in order to get uncorrupted, uh, like, grass up to my base up in the sky, I had to, um, I had to take and use a, uh, hoe on all the corruption as it got close. So I'd take and hoe it so it would go away. Only for it to come back later, then I had to hoe it again, and keep doing that over and over again until I got a completely uncorrupted area. You can imagine how fun that was. I'm gonna go plant a tree up there. Not a pretty neat village. Huh, neat. I mean, it's cor it's corrupted, but these structures themselves are sound and also fairly interesting. 